Hey guys, what's going on? East Bangers here, doing a little bit more metal detecting. And today oh, we're out here checking next to these giant tree trunks. And the reason these would be significant, and obviously this is a stretch, but I'm hoping that maybe somebody way, way back left something along the side of it and it just over time got covered up with dirt or they buried something here. It sounds far-fetched, like I said, but obviously that's how people find things sometimes, just by chance. And these have a significant age to them and uh that gives it the potential you could tell these things are pretty old I, I would imagine 60 60 years so it's possible someone could have put something near them and we've already got our first find here just wanted to give you guys an idea of where we're at what we're doing and um this is off next to stark's grade which has significant history in this area and it's actually if i'm not mistaken the first path used to get to sly park so definitely a heavily used path long long ago and this is obviously more modern of some sort of a bracket or something like that. Probably, I know that um, I was told that this mountain was part of the mountain anyway. It was formed with pieces of metal and everything that was on the property just to kind of create this hill here. But obviously this was probably just chucked up here. I haven't found like a little, uh, a lot of the other little objects I was finding in the area where the mountain was formed. So I think this was just a item that was tossed up here. And we're going to keep looking and we'll let you guys know what we find. So we have a giant piece of lead here. I'm pretty sure it was burned down and just melted into this. It's interesting. I'm not sure why people would want to uh, burn lead. It's probably horrible for the environment. and uh, Or it could be a piece that I guess was already burned, still being lead, attached to something as some sort of way to um, maybe an adhesive for metal on metal or something like that. Not entirely sure, guys. Yeah, Let's keep find here. And this is just a nail. Pretty modern nail, probably just chucked up here. Definitely newer. All right, guys, let's keep looking. Battery, it's a D battery, guys. Not good for the environment, just been sitting in the ground. And I know there's a well close to here, so obviously I don't think it would seep that far down into the soil, but either way, you don't want that in the ground. Not good for the environment. And uh, yeah, rusted battery gonna go ahead and put that in our bag we don't want that on our hands all right guys so here's everything we found and we're gonna run you through it real quick so we talked about it a little bit looks to be some sort of hinge it was only about five inches deep still looks to have some age to it a uh, piece of glass i'm pretty sure that's what i cut my hand on a uh, little piece of um looks like maybe some iron got two nails here a battery really glad we got that out of there you can tell it's starting to like corrode out looks like anyway got this giant piece of metal and that's been down there a while you can see all these little pieces and fragments i took out and um that's got some really uh a lot of significant age to that so giant chunk of lead here another sort of fastener hinge i think i mentioned the nails already and that's everything we found today guys uh definitely stuff that we don't want in the ground glad we got it out and we're going to keep uh, searching around here and see if we can find something cool. Nothing yet, but uh, glad we got the battery out. So thanks for watching, guys, and stay tuned for more.